Hey y'all, Farm Plant Killer here, Jesse with Living on Prayer Flower Farm. And I'm dealing with a really big issue right now. I'm running out of space. I don't have enough room for all my plants. Since I'm running out of space, there's only one solution. I've got to kill more grass. See these big, beautiful plants here? This is my amaranth. This one's my coral fountain amaranth. And then I've got my emerald tassel and amaranth. And I've got my dahlias. And they need to go in the ground. I also had a shipment come in from Jake with Wholesale for the Small Scale Grower on the Facebook group. I thought it was glads. I thought it was my order of like 200 glads and some dahlias. I, uh, I forgot I had ordered lilies. Day lilies. 250 to be exact. And I had no place to put them. Oh my gosh. Like, I was already struggling with where am I going to put these and the other glads. I have no clue. But now I've got lilies. And they've got to go in the ground today. Do you hear me? they got to go today. Okay, so here's the plan. Lilies are going to multiply. So this used to be my old flower bed. I'm going to rip out the old landscape fabric that I never finished ripping out. Till this up, amend it, get them in the ground. It won't be as pretty as my farm bed over there because they're, they're going to multiply. This area I've already planned, this is going to be the bulb area. I just wasn't expecting to prep it so soon. I completely forgot how I ordered all those lilies. Oh, completely forgot about them. So now I gotta deal with it. And it'll also be an area for the glads. So not that big of a deal, it needs to be done. I'll get it done today. My emerald. Yeah. Still gotta figure out where to put that. So <laughs> We're learning as we go. I'm learning it really is true. There's never too many plants. It's not enough garden. Or in this case, farm. I, I'm running out of room. So uh, let me get my gloves on and start ripping out this fabric. If you're just starting out, please don't make the same mistake I did. Don't buy this cheap landscape fabric. Because what happens is, the weeds grow through it and then it makes it impossible to tear out easily. Look, I mean, I'm pulling up grass with it because it's just pulled in so tightly. It's so hard to get up because of the weeds growing through it. So I'm about to have to get the hoe to start trying to get these grass chunks out so I can get out the landscape fabric. It's a complete pain in the rear. Mark my word. From this day forward, I will never use cheap landscape fabric again. Let me go get that hoe. waiting on my husband because I hate to wait and complaining about waiting on my husband. I'm going to get in my coral fountain and emerald tassels hammer using my wonderful tools. I've decided I'm going to put them back here behind the bachelor buttons in what is the vernacular bed because the vernaculars are dying down now. The heat's going to kill them. So I'm going to drill some holes using my tools. Love this thing and plop them down in here and eventually I'll run some uh, support through here as well. If you have not gotten an auger to go into a drill yet, you are missing out. This is the best thing ever. I love it. I've got a link down below if you'd like to buy one of your own, but these are awesome. Get one.
of plant tone and hope for the best. All right, now I just need my tiller to be fixed. We got the tiller going. It's been amended. I put down some cardboard box to try to help keep the grass at bay. I'll put some more along here as I get more shipments in. But I've got this big old box of bulbs of lilies to be exact. I got 50 of the Lily Dolly Madisons, 50 of the Lily Farnilla, Farnilia, I don't know how to pronounce it, I'll put it up on the screen, Lily Kingsville, I got 50 of those, and 100 of Lily Mix. So I'm not really sure what's all in the Lily Mix, but I know it's a mix of lilies, and they're here. So I've got 250 bulbs, gotta get in the ground, and it's trying to rain. So, let's work our way through it. So, it looks like I've got 75 of the Kingsville and only 25 of the Fernella, Fernella, if they're labeled right. So, there's a chance that they gave me one of the wrong ones or they just got mislabeled. I don't know, I'm fine with it. Completely forgot to order them anyway, so let's get them in the ground. <laughs> I need gloves. I'm gonna start with the mix. I'm gonna have the mix go in front. I think I need a shovel. Where's the shovel? Oh no, it's raining. day but we got it done so now I'm gonna end the day with just harvesting some of my snapdragons I'm hoping to use for Mother's Day look how pretty these are I love snapdragons do you hear me love them they are one of my favorite flowers thank you guys for watching i'll see you in the next one bye